Good morning, clan. Welcome to Seattle, Washington. It's Friday, and it is the first official day of Vlogger Fair. It's the Vlogger Day, which is just for creators, brands, people in the industry who kind of want to talk more about the business, uh, not all the screaming fans. That's tomorrow, that's Sunday. Um, so we are just about ready to kick it from our room. Everyone's looking fabulous. Look at Sierra's little tight action going on. And what's this thing called here? What's this thing called? I want to say a smock, but that doesn't sound like fashionable. I'm not sure what that is, but it's really cool. It looks really good. Some pause. Mommy doesn't know either. Okay. <laughs> and mommy's hair looks awesome. It Blonde and red. Shirt. It does match her. She yeah, totally matches like her shirt. Orange matches her hair. <laughs> and then you got the, the lurker in the corner. We're matching. Oh, you guys are all matching. We're all kind of. Or nah. Orange. Yeah. Orange. Sorry, Sierra. We're a little all mixed up a little bit. Huh. Well, you guys are all like good stuff. Good stuff. Look at. Oh, get up there. The guys are cleaning windows. Super guys are clean. And then. The guys are cleaning windows. Yep. We Window wash jars. Look how far down they are. Hardcore jobs right there. So last night I got a little gift here from HTC and uh, I was so excited to open it but I was like, you know what, I'm gonna wait, do it in the vlog so you guys can see what I got because I kind of see what's in here already and I'm super excited. A uh, little letter here from them saying, proud, uh, HTC is proud to be a sponsor of Vlogger Fair and uh, they're excited for this week's and weekend's events. I've been selected to receive the HTC Re camera. Uh, and a bag of goodies to use with it. Check this out, you guys. Woo! It looks like a little periscope. It's a camera. Isn't that cool? It's like a tube. It's the HTC Re, and it says uh, it's 1080p, 16 megapixels, wide angle, and waterproof. Look how small it is. That's the camera right there. What's the part? Periscope, they like to use it for like submarines. That's how they pop up and like look out above yeah, water. That's what I was that's what it totally looks like, I right? Know that's what it was called. And it's really small and compact. That is really cool. So it's waterproof. Uh, let's see what else it come with. It came with, they, they put in here a little uh, like case, a foam case with some straps and a carabine. So you can like strap it onto like your uh, belt buckle or something, right? And we got, oh, a clip on, check this out. It clips on right there and you can like, like hook it onto your backpack. And so like you can kind of like wear it on like your backpack while you're walking around. Oh, I, I'll probably do that this weekend. Very cool. Intuitive controls. Just grab, point, and shoot. Grip sensor instantly turns on the device. So just by grabbing it, like it turns it on. Very cool, very cool. Oh, I'm going to have some fun playing with this this weekend. Well, thank you very much, HTC. I'm very excited about this. I don't, I, I'm excited to try this out. It's like, a, it's like a new action camera, man. I like the design. I'm a big fan of like ergonomics and, and design functionality, so yeah. More to come about the HTC Re, for sure. This thing is awesome. You know, Vlogger Fair's been different every uh, single year, and I wanted to kind of run through it in, in my particular presentation. And it's not, don't worry, I, I'm not a big presenter type of person, I'm a talker, which makes me great for video. Uh, horrible for editing video, but a good talker. I guess I'm here to talk about race stuff, so, so white people. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, I, uh, I recently just started uh, talking a lot about kind of race relations um, kind of in America because there's a lot of different things going on. Um, and just a little bit about me, um, my wife is black, I'm white. And so we, we have, I guess, an interesting dynamic. Showed up to watch your video, that showed up to see your show, that came to a conference to meet you. And like you just, even you know, like you said, like one person, you make any kind of difference. Um, it's an incredible thing because every day, like we watch videos and we're moved to be different and to be better and to, you know, as you learn better, you do better and pass it on. I think that to be a part of that is a really incredible thing that um, YouTube provides. All right, guys, so the first half of Vlogger Day is about to break. We're getting ready to go to lunch. So many people are here. I pretty much see familiar faces all the way around me. And there's so many kids. That's the cool thing with Vlogger Fair is there's so many. Everyone brings their kids. And so there's babies and kids. I think our kids might be the oldest ones here. But uh, it might be. I'm not sure. I think our kids, what do you think? You think our kids are the oldest ones here? There's this girl here. Probably so. So they're running around playing with all the little ones. There's two on strollers, all kids running around crawling. That's good stuff. So this is the site of Vlogger Fair 2015. This is the same place we were at for 2014. And uh, it's the day before, the, the calm before the storm, if you will. Uh, they're still setting things up. This is the scene, and this is where we're having lunch. And we're literally the first ones here. First dibs on subs. 
cookies, chips, it's Jimmy John's, we're super excited. And the crowd is now coming in, so we're the first ones here, and we're gonna pick out. Yeah, yeah! <laughs> Check it out, guys. We seriously beat the crowd. The line is forming already, wrapping around. Uh, I do want to mention that the food is courtesy of uh, a sponsor of my price and fine feature points. It's how we pay for Jedi's diapers. Alright you guys, so vlogger day has concluded here at Vlogger Fair. Uh, we've got uh, about three hours until tonight's party. So we're probably gonna walk around a little bit, let the kids ex stretch our legs and explore. We'll uh, head back to the hotel, rest up, change, charge up, and then we'll head out for some dinner, and then our last night's party. Kids, this is probably one of the coolest gardens you'll ever see. Not that it's like the coolest garden ever, but it's one of the coolest gardens you'll see because we live in Arizona where there's not a lot of cool gardens. But look, it's like a little maze, like through a garden. Isn't that cool? So at this point, guys, we're just making our way back to the hotel, just kind of walking down Fifth Street. This is where the monorail track is. We're just walking along Max. We know that's gonna take us back to our hotel. <laughs> These guys are goofing off, playing around. And Sierra just made a comment just how she loved the trees, the canopy of all the trees underneath us. And it's on both sides of the street. And I said, yeah, a lot of streets are like this where they're super tall trees because it rains a lot here in Seattle. And uh, it's one of my favorite parts of this part of town and as well is that it's just an overgrown canopy. When Tiff and I were here a couple years ago, we walked down Central and the entire streets were like this. The buildings were like old. Like these are obviously been rebuilt or brand new. They're like very retro looking, but down Central, remember Central had like old buildings and it looked really cool. There was a coffee shop with the windows were all open, like the whole wall was like open. It was really cool. Hello. Hello. So quick change of clothes uh, for a couple of us, just to, you know, spice it up a little bit, going to a party uh, and then dinner, or dinner then a party, something like that. Um, change my shirt, but hey, this, uh, this HTC, Re charged up and ready to go. So we're gonna give this thing a try. I forget what button it is. is it this one? This one. Oh, I think I just took a picture. <laughs> uh, hold it down, maybe? I'm recording. I'm recording right now. And I'm gonna change to this view, I assume. I'm recording right now. And I'm gonna change to this view, I assume. We'll see what it looks like going from this camera to that camera. Now, the view, there's the view, and there's Sierra, Hi. and there's Bryce, and there's me. Oh, I can, oh, I can let go, so I can still record while I'm, I don't have to hold the button down. And then I click it again and turn it off. Yay! So we're gonna check out that footage there uh, tonight, and then uh, I'll probably use it more, a, little, a lot more at uh, Vlogger Fair tomorrow. Cantina Lina, and uh, we just got some appetizers because we ate lunch, we had a big lunch a couple hours ago, and we know we're meeting up for burgers later on. Uh, check out these appetizers. So, this is the three amigos we've got guacamole, we've got queso dip, and we've got some kind of like aioli, like popcorn, corn nuts, something, something. It looks amazing. And this is uh, ceviche, which is exactly what I wanted. Yay or nay? So I, you're like kind of, you do like it. Hey, all right, cool. Sierra, you want to try it? You don't want to try it? Really? I think I'm going to try it. Just try it. And the ran out our appetizer trio. I don't even know what these are called. These are um, charred padron peppers. The lime cream cheese sauce. They smell amazing. Yeah. What do you think of the peppers, Bryce? Good, huh? 
You like it, Sierra? It tastes like a bell pepper. What do you think, Tiff? They're alright. They're alright. Alright, so we have made our way over to the EMP Museum for a little after party action here. So we finally get to meet Jedi. Look how much hair she has. She has so much hair! Oh my goodness! She ripped her bow out. Oh. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So if you guys remember, we, Tiff and I were here, um, we came for the party, but then the next day or two days later, we came actually to the museum and actually visited the museum. This place is pretty awesome. We're on the fence whether or not we're going to come back and bring the kids, but uh, it's a really cool opportunity, if you, uh, experience if you ever come here to Seattle. Check this out. This is old school Nintendo. It's Mario on a Wii U. This is, this is the first, that was the first Mario that they were just, was just on. These are old, these are all old games. Oh, wow. Very cool, very cool. Hey, he's right there in the red hat. <laughs> are you a better motorcycle rider than me? I bet you are. Do, do you know that he? Do you know he has the same? He has your old bike. He has your old bike. Honda eighty. Or it's a one ten. It's a Baja. You had a Baja though. The your first one was your Baja seventy. Which one? The little red. The red one? one. Yeah. That's a Honda. And do you have a real yeah. Honda? I thought I your first so. one was a Baja. I can't remember. I do have a KLR six fifty though. That's pretty cool. That's that's super I legit. It yesterday. <laughs> I've dumped it twice now. I was pulling up and I was doing this thing, like as I pulled up, I was trying to get off and it started tilting that way. I was like, oh, and I had to just jump this way. And now my throttle's stuck. Oh, fail. I just got it. So they, they wanted to meet you. They never, never, never met you in well, person. I, I, we, I hang out with the parents all the time. We're like, <laughs> they were so excited to meet you. All. Really? Yeah. yeah. I was like talking to Bob. I was talking from social media. Yeah, and he's like, I'm like an orange, orange. Yeah. I was like, what? Yeah. What? He goes, he goes, Shay Carl's here. I'm like, okay, <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Go say hi to him. Give him a high five for me. And they're shutting us down. They're actually kicking us out. I want to say we were here later last year. I can't remember, but uh, everyone's still here uh, talking and, and mingling and sharing stories. We got Charles Trippy, we got uh, the Daily Bombs, Courtney, Chad, Gabe, Babe. There's, there's tons, tons of people here, and they're like kicking us out. They're like, "You need to leave. You need to leave." We're like, "It's nine o'clock. Where are we supposed to go?" So I'm not sure where we're gonna go next. Where the conversation is gonna continue. But uh, vlog affair is just kicking off. 10 p.m. here on the streets of Seattle. We're uh, looking for Dick's Burgers and Shakes. Uh, kind of like an after party. After party to the party. And uh, Chris and Diana took us actually to Dick's when Tiff and I were visiting uh, one, uh, a couple years ago. Uh, and I remember it being really good. I don't think, I, I don't think we got a milkshake because we just had pho and then we had a beer and then we went and got Dick's. And I remember stuffing myself, but it was really, really tasty. So uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to enjoying a Dick's burger. And this is Dick's. Very similar to In N Out Burger, very simple menu. Like burgers, fries, milkshakes, that's it. They have like three options, no customization. It's like, it is what it is. And this is a Dick's Deluxe. Open it up, Bryce. Open it up, Bryce. Oh, it's cheesy. I see cheese, I see lettuce. Oh yeah, cheesy goodness. You guys realize it's 10 p.m., right? You guys would be in bed right now if you were at home. High five for YouTube. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, guys, so we made our way back to our hotel room. Kids are getting snuggled up into bed with their devices. They're gonna be watching some movies. I think, Sierra, you're doing Stuart Little? Mm -hmm. And Bryce is doing the SpongeBob movie. Even though we've already seen it in theaters, he's gonna rent it and watch it again. They got their uh, little buddies with them, Spotette and Mr. Bananas. Mr. Bananas. Mr. Bananas. 
And so, uh, you know, cuddly and cozy. Snapchat. I already logging. I call that. I'm Snapchatting. Oh, get around them. <laughs> I don't think she's gonna make it. Go, go, go. Oh, you're gonna smush the pizza in. <laughs> Go, 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 go. She didn't make it. Hey, round two. She didn't make it. That was very close. That was close enough. Close enough. I looked so you had almost had it. Ellie, you're so funny. Try it one more time. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Did you guys see Bryce's uh, pizza sledding box? No, he yeah, took a, I saw He that. took a pizza box and slid down the side of a hill. Genius. And then he ate the pizza. <laughs> oh no, seriously? He's like, lunchtime. All right, guys, so I just left the daily vlogging crew up in their awesome little suite they have up there, heading back to our room. Tiffany ditched us a little early. She's not, you know, as you guys know, she's not a night person. She, she, needed, she needed to go to bed. And uh, we were playing a game called Things, or all the things or list of things I don't I don't know what it's called it was it was really fun actually especially the group of people like that and uh, so good times good times but uh, it is uh, 1 30 in the a.m. and I still have to edit so do all those guys they all have to edit um, I think Cullen might be the only one who was pretty much done editing or close to it because um, we all have to be at vlogger fair tomorrow at like 9 a.m. well 9 a.m. if you want breakfast like 10 a.m. for everything else so I uh, hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Tap that eye in the sky for the last three years' videos. Uh, check out the links down in the description below. And we'll see you tomorrow for another action-packed day. Tomorrow will be an action-packed day at Vlogger Fair because all the fans will be there, all the vendors, all the sponsors, the actual expo hall will be all lit up, lit up and uh, it's going to be a good time. So stay tuned.